That was pretty cool. <laughs> hey guys, quick update on the Spencer Pro event that is coming up December 9th and 10th. December 9th is gonna be a pre-party where we hang out. It's gonna be located at Schleba Engines. It's gonna be the night before. And then the 10th is the actual pro event at Greystone Event Center in Worcester, Ohio. So Sean mentioned this on a live the other day. I'm not quite sure everybody caught it. So I did wanna give a little update. Um, Kohler was very generous and stepped up and was like, hey, we wanna donate some money towards your event. So what we're gonna do with that is the first 200 people that sign up, your tickets are only $99. Kids under the age of 18 are always free, and we do have a couple's ticket package for $150. Now make sure whenever you go on, if you're going to join us for the pre-party, you grab those tickets as well, it's free. Um, also, if you want to bring a toy for kids, again, for donation for the Marines Toys for Tots, and the two local churches that we're gonna to donate to, that is more than welcome as well. We're gonna have a Christmas tree set up. It's gonna be fantastic. Um, but yeah, the link is down in the description. Tickets are going fast. Make sure you grab yours up and we absolutely hope to see you there. What you doing there, bud? I'm replacing the tongs that I broke. Okay. Okay. So, Tisha's been begging me to come work. And what's Tisha do on her first day of work? Uh, what's she do, TQ? She late. She's late. 29 minutes late on your very first day back after begging somebody to come work. Well, Savannah said, don't forget your ear protection. And I was like, oh shoot, and I had to scramble all over for that. And then I was like, oh, what shoes am I gonna wear? Cause I threw away my old shoes that we used to work with you guys. I'm like, well, I guess you use the ones that Tucker chewed up, so I use those ones. <laughs> so you brought your shoes your dog chewed up? Yep, on the side right here. Oh, that's not bad. No, there's multiple spots. All right, guys, so good morning. How good are y'all doing? This is my niece, Tisha. If you guys uh, don't remember her, longtime subscriber as well. She's came out with us quite a few times. But uh, yeah, she's been begging to come back, and she was late on her first day. So not starting off too hot. Uh, but I'm fine, guys. <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> TQ and myself, we were ready to go. Yeah. Hmm. But hmm. Savannah did send a text. No hmm. rush. And I did I <laughs> didn't I just tell you I need to not be so literal with her? Yeah. Like I should not have said no rush. You don't to today's children you don't say no rush because oh, that yeah. means don't rush. Like,
so there's been a semi parked here all year and we haven't been able to trim this area because we don't want to hit the semi so the semi is out of here so we're getting it cleaned up a little bit real quick wanted to point out real quick so this lawn was starting to bounce back there just a couple weeks ago and then last week we went 90 plus for that whole week no rain at all this lawn is going back towards drought very rapidly so you can kind of see out here if the sun's not blinding you guys kind of green and then brown so we need some moisture for sure
it is field day. We do this typically about every six weeks. That's all they want it done every six weeks during the summer and spring. So uh, I'm gonna tackle it. So I'm only out here today to get a tan. Maybe a little bit of work here and there. But let me t tell y'all, let's take a moment and look at these stripes. Look at those. Look at those, some greenies coming back. We're getting some rain tomorrow, which is pretty nice. So more rain, more green grass, yeah. <laughs> Now this is a bumpy field, so it actually is pretty good practice that, you know, practicing on a bumpy field because you have to learn to control a lot better. I think she got a little confused because I told her when we were standing down there that she's going to follow the stripes, light, dark, light, dark, but whenever you come to the other side, it changes, which I tried to explain it to her because it's the whole illusion the sun gives from it. Hey.
think? What do you think you did? I think I did pretty good. Yeah, the you did. The first, the first one. I was like, okay, now I got a hang of it. Well, okay. you, you were keeping it pretty steady. I will say because um, this is a bumpy, bumpy uh, field, right? Yeah. So being able to keep it steady is actually pretty good. <laughs> so, uh, but what I'm gonna do, we can go ahead and grab the other mower. And just so you can get practice, I'll let you go over without just getting the feel of the mower. We don't want you to mow just yet, but you can just practice, you know, just going over my, my stripes and I'll just continue to mow. Oh, okay, cool. All right. Alright guys, just walked out here real quick. I'm working on some bed maintenance, just cleaning some thistle up and just uh, any little thing. Got a lot of uh, nuts edge on this property right now. At nuts edge, we uh, typically have sprayed by the FERC company that comes in here. But this year, man, it just seems like every time they spray it, it doubles, triples. It's absolutely insane. So girls are out here practicing. Well, DQ's mowing, Tisha's practicing. This field here, we mow once every six weeks and uh, just really keep it maintained. As you can see, the multi-force can handle it, no problem. If it was wet, I would have probably brought the 6,000 or when we had the X mark, we'd have brought it. It's doing good though. Got a brute can of nuts edge and thistle and all kinds of stuff so we're not going to mow much out there but we are going to clean up by the roads and some of the areas we're going we're heading back into a drought here so unfortunately haven't had a ton of growth how's your tongs working they're working great Dang, you just hit everybody in the face sorry that sounded real convincing to you sorry guys much better <laughs> i even saw a teardrop that's sweat so we got tisha still she's actually mowing now so she made it about halfway she was doing really good i told her go ahead and fire them blades up and finish out the field out there or, you know we always double cut it so yeah yeah she's doing good though she's she looks like she's starting to move along a little bit so i i did mention in another clip that her hands are super tiny yeah and the distance between here and here is is a little tough on her she's doing all right though look at her she's cruising back there yeah but i would say if only they made this adjustable toro what'd you say i said if only toro made this adjustable for us small-handed little gals yeah 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 and just, some guys let's grow bigger fingers <laughs> really i'm gonna get mowing i'm done growing
up guys so i'm mowing a little bit of this side tq is finishing up this bed it was the only one i didn't get to so a little bit of thistle up front teach is about done it looks like but it's actually raining like we need this bad a big time you guys probably won't pick it up though but Will the kids say raindrop, drop top, flip flops, socks and crocs? It's getting dark. Like what I'm seeing. Some of our friends already said it's been pouring on them. Oh yeah? Yeah. About an hour west of us? Yeah. That's good. It's good. Let's get it packed up. Are you, you going to grab that gate? Yeah. Come on. See? You're not even helping me. I'm trying to teach you. Like, this thing ain't light. You just sitting there staring at me. Oh, you you get it on your one hand. I can normally, but hey, oh, when we got... When we got two people, you know that you know you're getting paid good. Oh yeah, I hear you. Uh, just messing with it. A little family love, you know. All right, guys. So the rain is here, and it looks like it's gonna be here till five. And uh, yeah, it's just a little bit after noon right now. So got about a good half day and a little bit over. But you know, we would have probably got another one done, which <laughs> you know, I won't say anything. We won't say anything. Somebody was late this morning. 29 minutes, Tisha. That's a half of a small commercial property. Well, we already discussed it. We already discussed it. We did. We already went over. Hey, really good job, though, on the mower. Learn it. Love you. Good job. Thank you. Uh, proud of you. That's, you know, first time ever being on the stand now, right? Yeah. Well, you teach me before, but it's been two years, I think. Yeah, I taught you the 6,000, right? Or was it the stand on? It was a stand on. It was one. in our driveway. I think it was our, when we had the right. We ultimate. actually had another. Oh thing. no, that's when you almost ran it into the garage. Yes, but there was another time you took me out in the field. Field. There was another really? one. Yeah. Okay. We have a video on that, but it's it's like two, three hey, years you ago. Tisha runs the TikTok for us and Instagram every now and then, guys. Go over there and say hi to her. But also. You should find that video where you almost ran the mower into the garage and make a TikTok out of that. All right, I will have to do some searching. <laughs> <laughs> Anyways, guys, we're kind of just hiding in the truck right now because it is coming down. It me, Savannah, to get Chipotle. Oh yeah, I told them because I'm gonna go in here and start working. And I told them lunch was on me. They can go ahead and go take a lunch break at Chipotle. And then we when you guys, that. yeah, no problem. And then when you guys get done, I got some more work for you to do. Oh, really? Really. Oh, really? Maybe yeah. I just won't come oh, I back I was until after lunch. later. You guys aren't going to come back? I thought I was done after lunch. <laughs> you're not getting paid for lunch, so you're done now. <laughs> All right, guys. So this is uh, the new channel. We're going to rename it Not Spencer Lawn Care Anymore. It's going to be TQ and Tisha Show. So there you guys go. <laughs> I'm going to make a run for the house. A run for the money. I need your money. <laughs> Just kidding, it's our money. What is yours is mine, and what is mine is mine. Exactly. Here you go, it's on the business. Okay, thanks. Beta power? All right. Yep. Beta power. There you go. No wonder my face was taken earlier. <laughs> We got Tisha C4 energy drink this morning. She doesn't drink energy drinks, which I normally don't drink C4s because they make you tingly lingly. But uh, she's like, why is my face numb? We're like, uh, that's the energy drink. It's coming down, coming down. We need it though. So yeah, <laughs> she's like, I don't know why my face is tingling. All right, so what's up, Teddy? Have you showed everybody your haircut? You look like a good dog. <laughs> good dog, let's get an all out. So, uh, <clears throat> somebody now has to be in the cage when we leave. And we had to move the couch as well over to there because she uh, decided all of a sudden after we had her fix, she wanted to start chewing on some uh, woodwork. So, yeah, no more of that. She gets locked up in jail. Here, let's go to the bathroom real quick. No digging in the mud.
All right, guys, so I don't know when the GoPro shut off. I had it in hyperlapse. So I was just going to do a real quick lunch meal for you guys. Uh, simply just going to use a couple of lettuce leaves for the bun, tomato. I don't always do it like this. And we'll put a few little slices of the Cracker Barrel cheese on there. But uh, sometimes I'll just eat this with cheese on it and then uh, light mayo and mustard. So we're cooking that in Kerrygold butter as well. All right, guys, so there you have it. Lettuce, tomato, cheese, roughly about an eight to 10 ounce patty. Got a bag of Quest protein chips. These are 140 calories. This whole meal roughly is gonna be in between 450 to 500, I'd say. So yeah, just a healthier little quick meal for you. Bon appetit. I know people always ask, how do you use the lettuce and all that? Well, definitely not a bun. But if you choose to want to use it as a bun, I mean, you can make it work. I forgot a napkin. Mm. That is juicy though. Mm. All right, guys, so I'm going to work on some estimates here on the computer. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. I know it kind of got cut short, but it's still storming. That's a good thing. As I showed you guys during the video, probably TQ did as well. Things were kind of starting to brown up. So as always, keep mowing, keep growing, keep making money, boys. We'll talk to you later. TQ out. Peace. Bye.